Good evening, hello, hi, good afternoon, good morning, sunny bononi, awusheni, hello. Welcome to another episode of Wayno's World. It's your girl with the bads, with the bads, honey. Hope everybody's doing good, okay? Can I tell you, guys, let me tell you, I didn't know recording could be so much work but anyway let me let me stop with all that mess um so before we get into it please make sure to subscribe hit that notification bell comment like and let's engage guys let's connect okay you can find me on youtube no no you can find me on instagram at wayno w-a-n-o underscore mo it will be linked right there not linked but you know what i mean and twitter as well way no more um and let's connect let's chat let me know how you doing let me know how you feel about this video so let me start with the why so the first topic So the first topic for today is how to manifest things that you want in your life. As the title says, honey, so let me start with the why. The reason why I thought to do this video specifically, it's because it's worked for me. And I thought maybe if I could share my story, um, someone else will believe that it's actually true i am living proof guys i promise you it works but obviously it depends on belief as well so you know you you believe in things and they happen so let's first start with the definition essentially manifestation is bringing something tangible into your life through attraction and belief i.e if you think it it will come However, there is more to manifestation than willpower and positive thinking. Angelina Lombardo, the author of A Spiritual Entrepreneur, says, Manifesting is making everything you want to feel and experience a reality via your thoughts, actions, beliefs, and emotions. This definition is by theopramagazine.com. It's basically law of attraction. Manifestation is basically the law of attraction, right? It's thinking about something and really believing that you'll achieve it. But obviously that comes with a lot of work, like a plan of action and being grateful and blah, blah, blah. So I'll get into it and I will be giving you guys some tips and tricks on how to follow some sort of a process to achieve what you want through manifestation okay so let's get into the first thing is write it down okay you need to make sure that you are very clear with what you want so for an example if it's losing weight and you have to be very specific as well right so you'll say i want to lose 10 kilograms i'm not sure what it is in pounds for my international audience because i am right see what i did there exactly so it's basically, um, you need to write it down and you need to be very specific about it. So you want to lose weight. So you want to lose weight in three months time, um, 10 kilograms maybe. And obviously you'll have a plan of action on how to achieve that as well. Right? So you need to be very clear about what you want to achieve and what that is and how you're going to get there. And the second thing is visualize it, see it, imagine it, think about it. Like literally visualize it. You can literally download a couple of pictures that you want to achieve, right? Along with what you want to achieve. And that is obviously aligned with what you were to <laughs> what you want to achieve right so you can download a few pictures through maybe pixels or 
YouTube, oh, not YouTube, um, in Instagram, Pinterest, or whatever else, whatever platform you're used to um, downloading certain imagery for inspiration or, or whatever else, right? So you just need to visualize it, keep it on your phone, think about it, talk about it, share with obviously people that you're quite close with because you don't want to be sharing too many of your plans because you know, aren't they? You don't want to share too much, just just in case somebody tries to jinx it. Okay, so my earring keeps falling out and I'm not doing it again. Okay, I'm not gonna pick it up and put it on because I'm tired. Oh my God, I'm not doing it, okay? Anyway, the third thing is with create a vision board, guys, right? So you need to create a vision board. So as I said, linked to the second point is that you need to download imagery, right? Something that will speak to what you want to achieve something that will motivate you to want to achieve it you need to see it so when you're creating a whole a collage of pictures of the things that you want to achieve so that you can put it up your wall and see it every day let that be a reminder that these are the things that i want to achieve and you obviously need to be working to achieving that in terms of having a plan of action how you're going to achieve these things right like even if it's little like bite-sized um, short-term goals that okay in a month this is what I I have to have done you know maybe eating healthy maybe going to the gym you know just using um, fitness as an example to lose weight right so that's just some of the ways that um, you can create your vision board right to achieve your dream honey or your goals or your mission or whatever else you want come in Okay, so the fourth thing is have a gratitude list, right? You need to be very grateful of what, what you have already, right? You want to be, you know, grateful for the things that you have already because I believe that if you are grateful for what you have, you will be... If you, if you are grateful for what you have already, when what you achieve comes or when you achieve what you have what you had set out um you know you can appreciate it more and really trust in the process and really understand the process and be patient with yourself and you have to be fluid sometimes with your with the process right because sometimes it's not necessarily how you want to go about and achieving it sometimes things don't work out the way that you want but that doesn't necessarily mean that you won't achieve it it's just that you need to be fluid with your ways with your method honey okay let's be fluid but always keeping in mind the goal right so yes and the last thing is pray about it right it's also in conjunction with the fourth point right so you need to be quite um you know after being grateful obviously that works hand in hand with being prayerful you know if you're a believer in jesus and the lord hallelujah hallelujah so for the people that do believe in prayer and god and and, and spirituality um you know you pray about it you know you, you always have to be prayerful and grateful about the things that you want to achieve you don't only pray for good things that happen in your life also the bad so now i'm saying pray when it's good pray when it's bad pray all the time but for the people that are not necessarily spiritual or a believer in god or the powers that be or whatever else you want to call you know um your belief system you can also manif i'm sorry you can also um meditate right because that works hand in hand so if you're thinking about it you're, you're envisioning it you're you know why you meditate just thinking about about what you want to achieve that's sort of like the same thing as being prayerful right so that's that's me guys oh my god guys let me just also tell you a little story okay before you go don't don't leave guys okay don't leave so my story is that for 2020 i had set out to achieve a couple of things right and in 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 the five things that i had set out to achieve for this year i have already achieved two out of the five right so again you need to be fluid with your method and be patient with the process and being patient with yourself as well so I've achieved two out of the five, right? 
and that means it works guys so i'm not just speaking out of my it's real like it works i am literally living proof that manifesting something that you want to achieve in your life is possible okay it's possible guys anyway thank you so much for tuning in it's been great fun chatting so also let me know in the comment section how you guys have gone through manifesting and achieving what you have have you used a process or was it just thinking about it all the time just let me know in the comment section you know i would love to hear your opinion and your perspective of how you can manifest darling or let me know if you even believe in manifestation or not i would love to hear what you guys think thank you so much for tuning in it's your girl Wayno's world signing out peace and love your girl with the vibes Mwah. love you bye